Like I said, I'm a little bit just nervous, you know. Why don't you close your eyes and uh, think of your favorite moment with Kaylee. I'll give you a second. And then open your eyes and look right into the camera. Whenever you're ready. Mm. These other two photos, that was the night I got, this, this one. That was the first shot that I got of him after he asked me to marry him. I love his smile. It's just one of the most genuine, like full of life, you know. I'm not gonna cry. <laughs> so the first one's the first time I ever met her family. That was interesting. Her dad's a, a character. They're, they're good, good people, like just generous and nice people. You know? Well, you, you'll, you'll see. You'll meet Audie. All right, here we go. Who made the first move? Greg. Who paid for the first date? Ooh. What was the first date? I bought her a first drink, which was actually a really nice little, like, sipping tequila that she ended up just slamming. And I was like, oh, okay. Don Julio, 1942, man. You don't know what this is. <laughs> yes, it is. <laughs> this is the first drink we ever had together. Who's more romantic? Oh. Greg. <laughs> she is. I'm a close second. Of course. <laughs> you sure? Yes, 100%. 100%. 100%. Because yeah. I trip sometimes, but that's no indication to the athleticism. <laughs> Who wears the pants? Me. <laughs> Kaylee. Yeah. yeah. Who was a better dancer? Me. Are we talking like rhythm or. Who's more likely to cry during a sad movie? Probably me. <laughs> to my extremely charming and good looking husband. When I think back to the moment I met you, I knew it was you. And every day since that visceral moment, life's been the sweetest roller coaster. Through all the ups and downs we've faced, and all of those to come, I know that no matter what, everything will be okay. Because I have you, and you have me. You're my best friend. You are the most patient, thoughtful, kind, unique, endearing, Again, extremely charming and witty. Happiest person I've come to know, and so much more. <laughs> to know you is to love you, Greg. To be with you is a privilege, and to be your wife is one of the greatest honors of my life. give thanks for all the experiences you and I have had in our separate lives that shaped us into the people we are today. And I eagerly look forward to all the experiences we will share together that will shape us into the people we are destined to become. Thank you for always laughing at my jokes. Thank you for always inspiring me to accomplish the things that are hard. Thank you for always choosing love. Thank you for everything you are. You are my wife, my lover, my confidant and my best friend. Thank you, my dearest Kaylee. As we stand here today in front of our friends and family, I give you my heart, I give you my soul, I give you my life. I love you.
So I'm going to help you guys with some tips, all right? I've been married a little bit. I, I can help you with this. So I got some, some zip ties, which we call cable ties, you know, pulling everything together. It's been in the duct tape, right? <laughs> Five key pillars to keeping your marriage strong, all right? <laughs> the first thing you guys want to remember is communication. You need to have clear communication. Thereafter, you need to have trust. You need to make sure you're trusting each other, the decisions you make and, and how you do life together. Third one you need is, is understanding, Greg. Greg, you need understanding. I'm, Kaylee got you to quit smoking that I've been trying to get you to do for years. So that is great. Compromise. I think both of you from what I know are a little bit stubborn, so, so some compromise is good. <laughs> and then the last thing, which was actually mentioned a couple times, which is amazing, is being present. And I think Greg and Kaylee from you know, the towns of Florida, you guys are present. You know, you, you're in the moment, you're aware of each other, and uh, all of those things together, you'll build a perfect home. And, and, and once you have your home together, Greg, to keep her happy, you just have to get her flowers every now and then. And Kaylee, to keep him happy. <laughs> Love